kids podcast. <laughs> you can go slow. A kids podcast about. Hello, my name is Tess, and I am so happy to be here with you at the very end of our day to say goodnight. It is just such a good time to think back on what happened today, on how we felt throughout the day, and just wind down together. Are you ready? Me too. I love knowing all day long that I get to see you and hear about how your day was and how you're feeling. So first of all, I just want to say thank you so much for being here with me. I want to hear about your day, but before we do that, can you just run and grab something cozy like a blanket, maybe a stuffy, whatever it is that makes you feel nice and sleepy, go get it right now. Okay, go, 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 and then run back. Yes, good, and then find a really cozy spot. And maybe you could wrap yourself in your blanket tonight. There you go. And get your stuffy and give it a big hug. Maybe give it a little kiss. Okay. Now, I want to know what was something that happened today that was really fun. Can you think of something that happened that was really fun, that made your heart so happy? It was such a fun thing to do. And can you tell me about it on the count of three? Ready? One, two, three. Oh, I love hearing about the things that you do in your day. So thank you so much for sharing. Have you ever felt butterflies inside of your stomach? You know those butterflies that are like, and they tell you how you're feeling? I don't know. That's how my butterflies sound. So before you go to bed, it's really important that you say goodnight to those butterflies. So that's what we're going to do tonight because those butterflies can keep you up all night long. And we want to say, okay, butterflies, it's time for bed. And the thing is that those butterflies in your stomach that sometimes tell you when you're scared or excited or nervous, they're your butterflies. So you get to tell them what to do. So your butterflies live on your breath. As you breathe, your butterflies go up and they go down. So when you're having big, nervous, or excited feelings, you can calm your butterflies by breathing up and breathing down. And at night, you can put your butterflies to sleep like this. Close your eyes and I want you to imagine Just check in on those butterflies in your tummy and see how they're doing. How many awake butterflies do you have? Okay. And can you say butterfly number one? It's time for bed. Take a big deep breath in. Imagine that butterfly is flying up to the top of your head and let it out. And imagine that butterfly is flying all the way down into your toes because your butterflies sleep in your toes. Yeah. And say, I love you, butterfly. Good. Now, can you say butterfly number two? It's time for bed. Take a big deep breath in. The butterfly is flying up to the top of your head and let it out. And the butterfly is flying down into your toes. And can you say, good night, butterfly. I love you. Butterfly number three, it's time for bed. Take a great big deep breath in. Imagine that butterfly flying up to the top of your head and let it out. And imagine that butterfly flying all the way down to your toes and say, good night, butterfly. I love you. And you can keep doing this as many times as you want with as many butterflies as you have left awake in your belly. And then in the morning, you can wake those butterflies up again. Good night to you. Good night to all of your butterflies and good night to your big heart. Thank you to you for being here with me. I can't wait to see you tomorrow morning. Have an amazing sleep with lots of happy dreams. And remember, 
There is nobody in the whole world with a heart just like yours. I love you. And I love your big heart so much. Good Morning, Good Night is written by me, Tess Levitt. You can learn more about me and my work by visiting bigheartjourney.com. You can write to me or record a voicemail and send it to listen at akidsco.com. I would love so much to hear about your day, and I would love to hear the ways that you say good night. Our show is edited and produced by Matthew Winner, with the help from Chad, Michael Snavely, and the team at Sound On Studios. Our executive producer is Jelani Memory. And this show was brought to you by a kid's podcast about. Follow the show on Apple Podcasts or wherever podcasts are found, and check out other podcasts made for amazing kids just like you by visiting akidsco.com. Come.